I'm here at the Soup Kitchen Community Center in Jamestown where they're holding their 12th annual Great Soup Kitchen Sleepover, giving Suites the opportunity to brave the cold and see what it feels like to be homeless in Northern Ontario. Uh, tonight it's our big sleepover, for our, it's our biggest fundraiser of the year and it's basically just it's a poverty simulation. We're trying to give people a little bit of a taste what would happen if by chance you were to fall on hard times. and. Uh, like we're all maybe two, three paychecks away from poverty and being out on the streets and more and more like in the bigger centers, there's more and more people having to live on the streets now. There's a tent city happening in Ottawa now, which is our, you know, the capital of Canada. And you often think like, how in the hell can this happen in one of the richest worlds, you know, countries of the world? It really, you know, just with our economic climate and everything else, we have to continue to raise awareness with um, just the prices going up all the time. And poverty is affecting all of us in one way or another now. Even if you make fairly good money, our money no longer has the buying power it even had five years ago. We had 50 registrants this year, and um, right now we're looking close to 4,700 that we've raised so far. So far, so good. Everybody likes it. I mean, it's a little bit crisp tonight, but I mean, that's also a little bit of a taste of reality for anybody that may be going through this type of uh, existence that just you know especially at this time of year this is just so important just just to raise awareness that it, this could happen to any of us and people are people and we all you know we all have to learn to try to get along and to help everybody and life is really so short we should be trying to enjoy each other's company and you know especially as we're coming up to the christmas season they always say it's the most joyous time of the year well in reality it's not probably for 70 percent of our population just because of all the commercial pressure well, it started with us taking her little brother's box and like just bringing it outside for fun. And then she was scrolling through Facebook and she seen like something about it. So then we just decided that we wanted to do it. Yeah, we're um, coming here to see because some people um, are on the streets and this is like how we're seeing it for the night to see how it is. To raise awareness about homeless people 